Ain't snatched back, now you broke in this game time Brutal sim dog, any challenge can contain my hunger when it's playtime You better get the name right The 2K Guru, you better know it Get your popcorn ready, cause there's a movie showing Highlight like real, of the best One through five, I'm a threat IQ top notch, I don't ball like the rest My career player, but I kill when I step Out on the park, I get chills down they neck I walk in the park, I'm not done till I rest Let me keep it going, let me show you who the best 99, yeah I grinded that, my channel you subscribe to that So let's talk about Accelerator And this is one of the most challenging perks in the game because it's by far the best perk in the game and they made sure that you get this perk last because you have to unlock every other perk before you have access to accelerate now i'm gonna give you all some tips to try and make your life so much better it's gonna be crazy but i got you all man now there's a few things we gotta look for because not a, not everything will be highlighted here if you go by the completed because you're gonna see I'm not gonna be able to recall some of the requirements for some of these perks for example there is second chance perk whatever that one right there this one again sabotage this is the one where I think you gotta have a lot of steals or something like that but I'll show you all all that all that I remember I'm, I'm just gonna tell you all the best route to go now this one let's start off right here right the suppressor perk I went into the park. Let me tell you how hard this was before I decided to switch my method, right? I went into the park and played with randoms to get that well, that shots well defended on any, any affiliation. I went and played with randoms and took hella losses. So if you all look at my record now, that's me going to the random court and running with randoms and getting beat outside the head because I wanted to just get some well contested shot. It was a process, trust me. I am glad it's over. <laughs> and the next thing is this juice perk is the going to take the longest because you have to, this is right before you unlock accelerator and you have to play 20 games, right? Now let's get into the nitty gritty and how I really, really fast forward the entire process. What I did was this, right? For a lot of the stuff, let me show you this right here. I wasn't able to do this, right? I was not able to get this one right here. I wasn't able to get this, right? Because, of course, I messed up with the 5v5 on my first player. And then the gym was closed. So what I did, I went and created my 68. Remember when I dropped my 68 video? And I said, let me start the 68 account and see if the gym is open. That started off and the gym was open. I went and played, completed it, got it completed. So that's how I ended up getting this one done then of course Monday came in because during the week you get 3v3s but on weekends you get 5v5 and that's how you get that done so if you ain't get none of those or haven't finished any of those yet it's pretty much gonna take you either Friday and then Saturday or during the week and then we can I know how long that process is for you it's very based on when you start of course right now that's probably the most time oriented one but everything else you could do probably within an hour if you know what you're doing well probably more than an hour just for the 20 games because you got to get these 20 games this is going to take the longest but everything else is easy and why it's easy because i created this bill right here let me show you all this exact same bill i created and all i put on this bill this lock is what you need to create this six seven lock right if you all want to see the exact same bill right here, this is a bill I created on stream that I was planning on making that I will still be making. I just gonna be waiting to put VC on it. And let me show you all the attributes to the bill so y'all could capture the screen if y'all want. Let me just make my camera really small. Y'all could capture the screen if y'all want. Save it if you notice it still is all the way up there. The blocks is at 80. And you're gonna get a lot of contests and well contested shots, all of that that's gonna help you unlock these perks. So, this is the build I went and I just said, okay, let me just create the build. Let me just create the build, right? Bring up my camera real quick. Right now, and here, let me show you all the build right now. And here is the build, right? And this build is what really allowed me to 
really unlock all of these perks really, really fast. It was such an easy process because I created a bill and let me show you all where I put on attributes. I didn't care about the physical attributes, none of that. Check out the attributes. All I put up on this bill is steals, max that out, and then I put the blocks up. And that was it. Nothing else. And I was out there with a 75 overall and unlocking all these. To be honest, you might not even have to put steals on it because you're still gonna start off with like around 80 or 81 steel on this bill, or 82 or something like that. So it still is gonna be pretty high and you start off with silver badges. So even if you don't want to put VC on it, you could unlock it and you're still going to help you get some steals because you're going to have a lot of these badges still. Imagine that. It's, it's a total cheat code. I just wanted to not waste any time and just put some extra VC. And it wasn't a lot of VC because I didn't put anything on the perimeter defense. That's how it started off. It started off because these go to 98 to 99. So it starts really, really high by default. So. I just put a little bit more and it, and it didn't cost me a lot of VC to get it up there at all to be honest with you. The block probably cost more and this is what I took out there and got all the challenges with the steals and all I did was go into the game. You see now they give me accelerator pro perk of course, right? You see it right there of course. And all I did was go into the game. All right. This is how I found my steals, right? Now it's not that easy. I gotta let y'all know it's not that easy. I put myself, and this is against what well, his name is, um, Soft Sir. What he does, he throw a lot of lobs to his two-way player here, Finini or whatever his name is. So I run with him. And I run with him. It doesn't matter. Whoever just run with two. And what you're doing is baiting a lob. You now it's very challenging. It's a precise timing, but trust me, if you get it down packed. You're good. So I'm trying to skip all this. All right. So as soon, but it's only when the point guard. Right? So I'm going to try to beat a little bit. Now with him, you don't work with him. You see that steal? You see that? So that's what you gotta do right there. That's what you gotta do right there. You see that? So that's. But it's not as easy as that all the time. So that's just one example. So if you could leave a game with three, four, you know, still, why do I try a bit? Well defended on a fast break. So it's just that simple to get that in the first person. To be honest, it's that simple to get the well defended on fast breaks. I'm trying to make sure he get baited right here to go for the lob. He got the steal, I'm mad. So what do you give the right spacing? See, steal, you see? That's all you gotta do, it's that simple, y'all. It's that simple. Trust me, it's that simple, y'all. And you just gotta keep spamming that. So that's two I just got there. He got the steal this time. Ah. Well, defending on the fast break, you see what I'm talking about? So easy. So it's a win win. It's a win win. No matter what, you're playing to win. No matter what. No matter what. If you want a lot of contest, trust me, if you want those well contested, click on the captain. He's found by Sunset, by Sunset Park. Click on the captain and he got a really, really low release. I'm going to show you a clip right now so y'all can check it out. So you know this is released and he will fire off at any he don't wait to be wide open anything just give him a little bit of window and you're going to see the shot coming and that's where you get your full contest with so you want to stack up those contests really really fast and 
The next thing I did, of course, right? I click on some dunkers, like two-way dunkers on them who was handling the ball and I will rice, take, steal anyone. But the good thing is you could do this against anybody, anybody. You don't have to be specifically disco or soft server, whatever. And it's all about focusing on those contests and steals. Trust me, with that lockdown, you won't get all of that done. Now, who already have a lockdown probably don't even have to do anything about it. But for me personally, I did not have a lot. My point guard don't have any steals on it at all. So you could understand the challenges. And a lot of point guards out here are worried, or even wondering how they're gonna get it done because all they have is a point guard. All you have to do is create a lockdown, max out the defense, max out the steals and the perimeter defense. You don't even have to put VC on it. And it's gonna start with close to an 80 something or something like that with the steals and you could actually go out there and still get steals. Now, if you put a little bit of VC on it, now you get the top tier badges and stuff like that. And, and the good thing about the rebirth is, by the way, the rebirth all of them start off with silver badges. So outright, I'm starting off with silver badges so I could go out there and spam up these steals, okay? So hopefully that tip helped you all out, trust me, you have to get all of them done, and it's not that hard once you get the lockdown. You need a lockdown. Trust me, you need a lockdown. It definitely helps. I had like one or two of these unlocked, and as soon as I got the lockdown, I just start unlocking stuff. <laughs> for real. And I'm tired of going around with random. So that's a, a little tip for y'all, man. Hopefully this video help y'all out again. The one that took the longest, probably the juice, because I have to literally play 20 games. But as far as the steel, once you right stick it and you can't fall out, you cannot fall out at all. But one, you, one thing you're gonna see is the CPU probably gonna get some blow bys on you if you spam the, at the wrong timing. So get a little bump first, then press the right stick, and then you will get away with that steel. So again, hopefully this video help you all out, man. If I saw a video like this that gave me that build to create, it would definitely help me a lot sooner and would save me some time going out there and play with randoms to try to unlock it. But this is so worth it. This, this right here is so worth it. By the time you do one or two things, you max out the takeover. And plus I got Mambo mentality, which means I got all the takeovers at once. That's OP as hell. So hopefully, man, this video helped you all out. Y'all know it's your boy. So if you're first time to the channel, make sure to like the video, share the video, and hit your boy subscribe. If it's not your first time, like the video, share the video. You never know who's gonna be informed, y'all. Your boy, say more love, respect, bless up. Peace.